Boom. Um, here we go. Uh, so I prepared some slides, which I have posted as well, um, on wrap-up and resources for further study. Um, uh, I give some suggestions for further education. This does include a semester-long course I teach here. Um, uh, and um, I also talk about Volker Grimm's course, taught in NetLogo, by the way, at Humboldt State University, um, uh, which is uh, sort of uh, Southern California, um, not so far from, um, from LA. I think it's not so far from Riverside. Um, and there's a court course previously taught by myself, Ross Hammond and Elizabeth Brook, more recently taught by Kristen Hassmiller Lich and my student Kurt Kruger, who you heard, at Michigan uh, Epidemiological Summer School, which, if you're interested, has some good features on it. Okay, there was also some conferences, and um, I, I quite like the SPP Brims conference, um, Sociobehavioral Cultural Modeling, um, but the Winter Sim Conference, the Micro Simulation Conference, the International Conference of System Dynamics Society, and ICHI. It's proper conference. There's kind of a, a would-be clone conference that's impoverished, in my view. Um, that all of these are, are worth considering. I'm not saying this is an exhaustive list. There's some other interesting ones emerging. For example, there's one on computational social systems um, and so on. So I'm, I'm, I'm trying not to privilege these, but just be aware I found value in these. Um, I'm going to Informs this year to talk about some of our modeling and some of my modeling buddies are there and I might recommend that as well. Um, okay, books. There's some good books on agent-based modeling, some good books on system dynamics modeling. Um, I'm, I really like Business Dynamics and Peter Hoffman's book on community-based system dynamics. Um, both of these I consider very good uh, reference volumes and very thoughtful. Um, uh, uh, Epstein has, has uh, a very uh, interesting computational social science book, and I mentioned the Rosbeck and Grimm book. Um, I've been thinking for years about writing up my lectures into a book form. If any of you feel passionately that I should do that, please let me know, because I am becoming sabbatical, and maybe I could work on that, and I have people <laughs> telling me it's not worth it these days to write a book. People don't learn that way anymore. And I have other people saying, write a book, write a book. Um, get it out there. And I'm interested in thoughts on the matter. I, I haven't decided, but um, I'm not a big admirer of, of Stephen Harper, the former PM of Canada. But he wrote a book on 15 minutes a day at the beginning of each day. He said he can always spare 15 minutes. And he'll, he started out each day, I think, by writing. And, 15 minutes of work on his book, and it finally got done. Um, uh, and uh, I, I could probably do that uh, at the least. So please let me know if you think I should work on a book. Um, anyway, um, okay, community support. Insight Maker Healthcare Areas and Health Areas. I really like Jeff's work here. I think it's very thought provoking, and it's, it's, um, it really gets you thinking about the heart of some issues. Um, this is one of the main things I want to bring to your attention. It's this health modeling community site that the NIH sponsored. And I want to spend the next little bit on this, okay? I also talk about finding partners um, and uh, engagement in UFS, okay? Um, the various things we do, our simulathons or hackathons on subject-specific areas, uh, the incubators, uh, the internships, collaborations, boot camps, student exchanges, um, contracts, um, uh, hiring, et cetera, et cetera. If you're interested in the possibility of exploring these, we have a kind of an ecosystem built up, and Christine um, can help guide you through particulars of this. She handles all the administrative side to this and lets me focus on other things. Those of you here, many of you will realize that uh, two weeks ago I was concluding a, uh, a separate boot camp on data science and system science, big data and dynamic modeling, or what I like to call data system science now, or system data science rather. Um, and this gives a strategic vision, conceptual foundations, and guidance for combining these sort of models, as, and, and the system science models with big data 
and machine learning and, and techniques from data science. Um, the previous iteration, which just finished, I showed there, if you're interested, let me know. I'm trying to figure out what month we offer it, and uh, I've got some possibilities, and I'd be glad to discuss it. Um, uh, some of them um, are at the end of 2019, in fact, in coming months. But the main thing I want to talk about, all these slides are available to you right now on the site, but the main thing I want to introduce you to, ladies and gentlemen, the thing that excites me, yes, Wade. Sorry to interrupt. I just want sure. to point out in these slides, the, the hyperlink to builtmodeling.org is messed up. Oh. And it will take you to what I think was a former development site that now is squatted by a, some ad. Oh my gosh. Okay, so if you type that in. If you type in healthmodeling.org, <laughs> okay, good to <laughs> much appreciate Wade's um, sage words there. So that was not my intention, uh, please let me assure you. Um, <laughs> you know, it's not going to like extract my wallet. Um, dot org. Is it this one or this one? Both of them. Both of them. Well, well I'll be. Um, so help me, help me figure out what's broken here. It, it actually goes to healthmodeling.archdev.com, which I think was, was, the, was, the, was the development that's, site. Yeah, yeah, no, no. That's, it's some, okay. something. Oh, bit. oh, I see. Okay, it's, it's the first one is doing it for me. Okay, health modeling. Okay, fine. So type that in to your browsers, though, if you wouldn't mind. No, I mean the healthmodeling.org, not the other one. Uh, the other one was just the development site. So healthmodeling.org. HTTPS. This is the NIH sponsored site, okay? And I would like to walk you through that. And to that end, I'm going